Hello, 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 and welcome back again to another Destiny 2 gameplay video. Again, I'm here with my friend, Jack. Hello. And we will be playing some more Red Legion War story campaign. Currently, our story takes us over to the Nessus planet. And it's called Looped. Arcadian Valley. No one's heard from Cade 6 since the hunter took off for an uncharted world. Track him down. That sounds interesting. Wonder what happened to Cade. Hmm, indeed. Indeed. Curious. You ready? Probably with his track record, so probably something really stupid. <laughs> yeah, no kid. Not only that, he's got that, you know, cocky side to him. Which, yeah. which gives him that great personality of his. <laughs> Alright, you ready? Yep. Well, let's begin. Launch now. I just, you know, I love it when he tries to do his best, but then when he's left with, like, you know, what he would call homework, and he tries to pawn it off on somebody else. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Explains why he's so close to Hawthorne to get oh. favors to point off his work. We're going to find Cade and Icorus. Luckily, we picked up an odd signal from Cade's ghost. It's being boosted somehow from a centaur called Nessus, which is strange. Centaurs are really just big rocks in the outer reaches of the solar system. There should be nothing there. Well, we might be surprised. Yeah. I also love how we're doing in opposite order. He said he needs Ikora and Cade, and we're doing Cade and Ikora. Oh, yeah. That, that's interesting. Oh, cinematic time. Ah, yes. X Milk. <laughs> <laughs> Is that all you can think of when you see it now? X Milk. Ah. Say thanks to Ghost. Let's get to high ground so I can pin down Kate's. That's location. true. That's true. Can't deny that one. Alright. Let's dish out business. Alright. Back on the planet Nessus. Here we go. Tracking Kate's okay. signal now. Whee! I think I'm getting something. Let's go. I haven't gone this down this thing in forever. Vex trapped? What is Cade getting us into this time? He... Something around here is blasting that signal into space. We find that something, we'll find Cade. <laughs> he he admitted he's in over his head. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Ooh. Uh, that... Like we're to that big ship. Oh. I didn't see that there. Yeah, sure enough. I wonder if he crashed in that thing. There. The signal's coming from that wrecked I wouldn't, I wouldn't put it past him if he did. <laughs> Reckless driving, you need your license revoked. <laughs> oh, what is this? Oh, wait. Yeah, we need to scan that, don't we? Are you here to oh, the yes. Oh, no. Whoa, you're not Cade. The Cade 6 is currently caught in a teleportation loop. He's over what? there. What? Now he's over there. Ooh. Oh, no. He's moving? Well, that's complicated. I can help you. But I'm gonna be super unpleasant about it. Oh, yes, you are. I'm sorry. What? What? I have uploaded his new coordinates to you. Against my better judgment. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, okay. <laughs> uh, yeah. You know, if I hadn't oh. met Failsafe for. Oh, what happened? We gotta go. They gave us the coordinates. She actually did. And she's being very unpleasant about it. Yes, I believe so. You know, if I hadn't met her first, just exploring, I, I would have been kind of like, okay, too. Yeah. <laughs> but she just <laughs> hates Kate <laughs> with all of her robotic heart that she has. <laughs> Ugh, I don't know what it is, but... Yeah, maybe just the Kate factor. I guess so. Yeah. Are you okay? You sound a little... <clears throat> Off. I am the Exodus Black's failsafe. Call me failsafe. Ghost, asking the questions that we want to know. Yes. Hopes he would be rescued. And look, here you are. Oh, I see. She's just an AI. A malfunctioning AI. 
Ouch. Oh. At your service. Centaurs are supposed to be just giant icy I love it. It's a, I heard that. At your service. At your service. I'm totally cool with that. Have achieved 92.014% conversion of the Centaur Nessus. Wait up for me. Oh, you're over there. I'm a little slow at the moment. I'm used to wearing um, my uh, boots on my your warlock. Transverse, your, yeah. yeah, your transverse and boots thing overs. Oh, that's Kate. Oh, hey. <laughs> don't ask me how this happened. I don't have time to explain what I don't have time to understand. <laughs> that makes uh, sense. Yeah, no kidding. I don't have time to explain something I don't understand. <laughs> well, I mean, it kind of, kind of makes sense, I guess. In some form or fashion. <laughs> this thing reloads really fast. That's good. What is it? Oh, it might be because of my uh, perk, but it's a uh, it's a Valkadin. It's my Mercer auto, auto rifle. Oh yeah, I think I've seen that thing. I've had a few of those before. The stern may have an odd shape, but it still proves it's worse. Definitely. Let's use on that one. I still love this mini tool though, it's really nice. It fires so fast and it delivers really good damage. I haven't really oh, seen yeah. too many submachine guns deal. Decent amount of damage like this. What exactly oh yeah. Here? I had a callous mini tool, but I kind of got rid of it because I didn't Ooh. like it. After the update, of course. Right. Mm, 750 for something that I took that I carried with me from like really low power to where I was then. It's like, eh, not worth keeping. Right, right. How long have you been here exactly? Long enough to see the Vex convert this entire planetoid. Kill all living organisms, oh, wow. molecules, and digitize brain waves for further study. Oh damn. It's a fascinating That's process. a long time. Yeah, no kidding. She sounds way too excited about that. <laughs> I agree with you on that one, Ghost. <laughs> too excited. Oh uh, she's she seems to love it because I guess she just loves information. That or she just loves death. Apparently. I'm putting on the ladder. She always thinks highly of herself, that's for sure. Because she's apparently the best AI. Oh, yes. Remember when uh, Ghost said, these Vex make us ghosts look bad. <laughs> and then Bailsay says, I'm sorry, but that's false. I always look good. Yeah. Oh, so that, was, that was a good one. All right. You are good at destroying the Vex. Much better than my crew was. She had a crew? Damn. I'm almost yep. afraid to ask, but... Failsafe, what happened to the Exodus Black crew? Only my captain can access those memories. And he's super dead. Oof. That's... that's rip. That's a big rip. Yeah. I don't understand why she's so calm about it. She's like, ah, uh, he's dead. He's super dead. Oh, yeah. <laughs> of course, she had to use her depressing voice. Just beyond yeah. that Vex gate. Please proceed. Please Won't proceed. Get stuck like Cade? Oh, no. My judgment module is much more reliable than the Cade. <laughs> See right there. Full of <laughs> much more reliable than the Cade We're units. Good. We're okay. Of course. The Cade 6 is not far now. You know, I'd hate to get stuck in a loop like Cade. Yeah. Imagine if imagine if failsafe was uh judgment was worse than Cade's. Oh. You probably would get stuck in a loop. Oh man, that that'd be I'm sure <laughs> they would stuck. throw us through some sort of roller coaster loop that ooh, hello. This is fancy. It's very fancy. <clears throat> hey, there he is. Oh hi there. Hail that first, then me. Hey, you're doing great. Thanks. <laughs> Please, you don't have to flatter us. Now get 
<laughs> Don't get away sad. Oh wait, wait, it's in mag time, I think. Quick, hurry, come on! I don't know how long this portal's gonna stick. Kate, what have you? Stop, 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 stop! Look, look. Long story, and it may look like I don't know what I'm doing, but I do. Uh, may, maybe not. Doesn't matter. <laughs> Killing the power source at the origin point should break the loop and get me out of the portal system. Have you got that? Say you've got it. Say something. Say something. I'll say it. We got it, Kate. Now, how did you go my cotton socks? Did you not? Know <laughs> 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 I'm guessing this is why they don't like him leaving the tower. Ouch. <laughs> Ouch. That bites. Poor Cade getting picked on. <laughs> well, he always does have a free spirit. Yes, he does. And boy, I tell you what, Bungie have a good way of uh, avoiding swear words. <laughs> they do. <laughs> Oh, oh my god, socks! <laughs> oh, that. Oh, his, his, uh. The way he acts, it just fits the situation so well. Yeah. Oh my gosh, I love it. I love those kinds of characters. Yep. Yeah, six. Uh, crashed colony ship and interspecies war kate six got that adventure he wanted go save him from it <laughs> gosh dang no, every good. every turn i would just get up start laughing it seems oh i gotta hand it to bungie they know other stuff he makes they make such a likable character <sighs> they do i'm just I'm just sad from spoilers earlier. <laughs> oh yeah. Uh. Get forsaken. That's what we need to get you. Forsaken. Uh, need to. Uh, da, 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 da. I mean, despite that, the only thing you'll actually take back is the, I was gonna say the thing will only get you is missions, and I remember it also gets you exotics and stuff. Yep, yep, yep. That'd be totally nice because I've seen an exotic bow. <laughs> Which under? I think it was it was given by Ada. It's something like butterfly or something. I don't, I don't remember. Oh, butterfly lock. It's actually it goes to it's a key. It's a what? I think it's a key you're thinking about. It goes to a, a container. We're at your oh, interesting. Cade is stuck inside a Vex portal system. Can you help us find the power source so we can get him out? Oh yes, by locating the original Vex teleporter to Cade unit. Where am I going? You can shut down the loop and free him. I can guide you there. Okay, so we find this Vex teleporter and shut it down. Easy. Oh, good one. Oh, okay. It's like, I don't know where to go. It's not pointing me anywhere. <laughs> Rip. I'm coming. Ugh. What is this stuff? Vex belt. It's called Radiolaria. You know, Vex mind. <laughs> hmm. This stuff is organic. Seems the Vex are not pure robots. Hmm. Interesting. Very. You had the smart idea. <laughs> Just bring your vehicle in. Oh, wait a minute. Yep, don't burn. Well. Elec <laughs> don't get electrocuted, that is, but your vehicle would eventually burn. True. Let's see what's the. Oh, hello. We got some bags. I would have eventually started burning because I was moving up current. <laughs> oh yeah, because I saw your vehicle touching it, and the whole electrical field was going haywire. Yeah. I forget that I throw mines with this uh, subclass. <laughs> you can change it because you can get the one that throws a grenade. What could have possibly Wait, Kate to with my melee? Yeah, I mean, I mean, you, yeah, you can change. I mean, you can change your grenade, or, and it will keep the charge. Gotcha. Cool. It's only if you change subclass, the sub subclass within the class, it, it, everything resets. Right. Oh wait, I remember this. Back up. Lots, lots of blowy guys.
Man, this thing has a big magazine. Yeah, it's 56 bullets. Not bad. Crap, you're not kidding. I'm just generating orbs left and right. I believe it. Minotaur! Dead. Dead. A good Minotaur is a dead Minotaur. No, we're not. Everyone I touches. I of the Vex would make me miss my captain and crew less. Did it? <laughs> it did not. It did not. <laughs> wow, so depressing. She is depressing. No matter if she tries to stay happy or not. Yeah. <laughs> She's just overall depressing. This is the Vex teleporter? Yes. The gate six will want it. You should pick it up. Okay. <laughs> hey, you did it! You got me out! <laughs> and where am I? <laughs> Kate, you, you are near the remains of my reactor core. Welcome to the Exodus Black. Where all your dreams come true. Where all your dreams come true. She's on Total Press me. she does that. She's on Total Press all the time. Give me a picture. Like you met my new friends, Failsafe and her evil twin, Failsafe. <laughs> Which is the evil one? That's a good one. If I had feelings, they would be hurt. <laughs> Looks like she needs uh, some implants, some antidepressant implants. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh -oh. got the I hear that the one, yeah. By Dizzy, I mean murderous rampage. I'll hunker down in the Exodus Black. Here, but my hull is in 108 pieces. Decks 1 through 20 are buried, and my cooling system. Uh, I am a mess. <laughs> oh, we know, Failsafe. We know. <laughs> yeah, we know. Indeed. Oh, big guy. Kill big guy. Gate Lord. Oh, nice. That the Vex has fallen to finish each other off? But then you'd miss all the fun. Oh. Well, I thought him to be harder. Yeah, I guess so. I guess he really wasn't as hard as we originally thought. Activating defensive shield. The cage All out of height. Meant nothing. Hey, nice one, yep. Bill. I was, uh. Hold on. That's right, though. They can't. Right? I was expecting it to be a little. tougher? Yeah. He just like, oh, no, I ain't living today. Right, where are we going now? Rendezvous I'll with Kate like... 6. Yep. Let's get the heck out of here. Run that Vex over. <laughs> yep. Uh, I love those chances. It's hard okay, to run yeah. them over, too. Yeah. Hey, shit, they're always on the move. Hey, do you so probably annoying. want to hustle? I think they just said something about ripping my beautiful horn off my face. Uh, my beautiful, beautiful horn? <laughs> my beautiful, beautiful horn? <laughs> uh, it's us. It's, oh man, now Ghost is getting annoyed. Where'd the guy go? I don't know, he teleported somewhere. I found him. Oh, he needs to die now. And dead. Nice one. Hey, that fallen dropped something. It's a freaking scorch cannon. Yes, I hate this thing. You know what? Can you pick that up? Yeah, you pick it up. You can have it. 
Did you say you hate this thing? Yes, I hate it. <laughs> oh yeah, PP, it's freaking OP. Okay, what? Are we supposed to just kill all the remaining fallen or something? Yep. I guess oh. so. You have saved us. Oh, there we are. Updating my crew log. New captain registered. Yay. Welcome aboard, Captain. New captain registered. <laughs> oh boy. Get to see her. Hey, hey, down, down, down. <laughs> It's like I got the light it. Found its way back to you. Not that I'm jealous or nothing, but <laughs> take it easy out there, will you? You're making me look bad. <laughs> sure. What? Yeah. May we ask, were you going to do with a Vex teleporter? Get up close and personal. And go. Put a bullet in his head. Then maybe eat a sandwich. <laughs> oh. Kinks first. Fun fact about the Vex tech: not as intuitive as you'd think. Cade. You can't do this alone. <clears throat> Hell, I can't. <sighs> Even if you manage to kill Gaul, when the Red Legion leave a system, defeat or victory, they leave nothing behind. The Cabal are bad guys who do bad things. Yes, I get it. I'm sorry, but I do <laughs> not think you do. The Cabal literally leave nothing behind. Oh. They have a weapon that can destroy a star, and it is pointed directly at our sun. Hey, 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 easy, easy. You're gonna blow a bomb. Zavala <laughs> has a plan. He needs you, Kate. Yes, well, Zavala always says he has a plan, but sometimes he just... Wait. He Zavala said... said he needs me? Oh. As in, you heard those exact words oh. coming out of Zavala's mouth? Oh. Yes, we did. Please tell me you recorded it. <laughs> well, did Agora at least hear it? Actually, Zavala lost her after the city fell. Uh. We don't know where she is. Io. Io, it's it's where she'd go to look for answers. Hey, um. Thanks. Oh, you are. Hey, you're welcome. <laughs> Don't get too far ahead of yourself. You already just did with the Vex. Now you think you can go up into some cabal ship and say, Yo, what up, pal? All right, I'm going to eat a sandwich. <laughs> yeah, I, that's cake for you. No kidding. Uh, I love them, though. Oh, yeah. Oh man. Ah, exit is black. Oh. oh, fail safe. Anyways, what is the next step? I'll. Wait a minute. Hold on. I have to talk to fail safe first. Okay. Hello. I probably just two ones I in. I am Speaking. I am so glad to meet you in person. I know you are going to I.O. Should you return, I will be happy to assist you in researching the Vex. We could steal their stuff. <laughs> that was a joke. Stealing is wrong. Usually. But the Vex are alien robot monsters. Standard moral parameters do not apply. <laughs> it's not murder if it's robots. Please come visit me again. <laughs> Everyone I've ever known is dead, and their bones are dust. I am very lonely. Damn, failsafe, you're so depressing. <laughs> first, first it starts off funny. She starts talking about researching the Vex and how we can steal their stuff. <laughs> we can steal their stuff. Just kidding, stealing is wrong. But actually, the Vex are just evil alien robot monsters. <laughs> Normal standard morals don't apply to them. <laughs> and, then, and then she goes to sit here and say, uh, let me remember this. Uh, <laughs> all my crew are dead. Their bones are just dust. Wow. <laughs> I was like, wow. damn. <laughs> First you turn into a laughable moment, and then you just, you crush it all in the end. 
sad. She's always sad. So, fail safe. The Exodus Black's artificial intelligence is ready to aid the fight against the Vex on Nessus. But now that Cade 6 is out of his jam, it's time to seek out Akora Ray. Akora, find what she has been searching for by completing mission Sacrilege on the Jovian moon of Io. All right. Let's do this. Vex Hub XYJ899 scan. Access not possible without detection. How bad could it be? Sacrilege. Since the loss of her light, Ikora has many questions, and she's not leaving Io without answers. Launch now. Yes. No. No, I don't think that. She talks to herself, doesn't she? Or it's just because we're in her presence, I don't know. She's weird. Uh, I have no idea. Seeing that she has a double personality, you know. <laughs> yeah, that's yeah, true. She does have... Yeah, I, maybe she's talking to herself. She might be just crazy. <laughs> she's acting. Oh. The whole place hums with energy left behind by the traveler's unfinished work. No wonder guardians considered this site sacred. Now that Kate is back in the fold, all we need is to find Ikora, make the Vanguard whole again, and bring down the Almighty. Ugh. Giant machine called the Almighty. That thing does need to go down. <laughs> yeah, it's huge. <laughs> huge, destructive. <laughs> Don't destroy our son! <laughs> you, know, you need it from a Vex. Uh, oh, man. What would you expect from Cabal? No, it's cinematic. Oh, yes. I love cinematics. Oh, there she is. Of all the places I've been in all the years since my rebirth, this is where I return. The last place the traveler touched. I came for answers. I stand here still with nothing. Ikora, Zavala is forming a resistance, and he believes... What good is a resistance when you are the only one who would survive? I believe this goal creature knows the Traveler blessed this site. I believe he sent his legion to find something they could never possibly understand. And I believe they will continue to desecrate all we hold sacred. Save this place, Guardian. Do not squander this second chance. I mean, I got a lot of chances. I got a second chance, I got a third chance, I got a fourth chance. I die a lot. <laughs> we, we've got as many chances as we ever need. True. Ooh. All right. Back here. And yeah, this is a nice view. Got to hand it to him. Yeah. I am curious about what all that is over there. Because... Maybe that's just where the traveler last was. Kind of had that shape. Good point. And it's kind of ran like that. Alright. Alright. Where are we going? Over there. How bad could it possibly be? No idea. Whoa. That bad? I don't know. What is that, Ikora? Energy. The Traveler's energy. What have they done? Uh oh. This is my fault. I could have stopped yeah. this. Ikora, there's no way. Not without your light. I am more than just my light. I could have tried. I should have tried. 
Maybe Looks she's like upset. The legion's packing up, Ikora. But after all the seniors dying, being reborn, dying again, the traveler has left me with one life, and I am afraid to lose it. That might happen anyway. Gaul has a weapon that can blow up our sun. The blue substance oozing from the cracks in the ground. That's the traveler's raw energy. What? Why would he destroy what he's worked so hard to conquer? Get into that base. There must be answers there. Yes. We must find the answers. Everyone's gone. We got this. Keep looking. It's not like the Cabal to invest so much in a base and just abandon it. Who knows? Cabal seems stupid. We're up on a big drill. That's a true. Drill? Are they mining the traveler's energy? Oh boy. Energy? Yeah. It's not light. It can't give the traveler's blessing. Not to me, not to Gaul. Or could it? Ikora. This isn't good. What do you see? I don't know. Dimensional rifts. Some kind of magic. Interesting. The Taken. Oh yes, these ugly little punks. Well, I'm prepared. Yep, let's do it. <laughs> As you light him up with the first grenade. Yep. There's more of them. Oh, jeez. This game's trying to blind me. What? That hits idea, those? yeah. The Taken. A mindless army of stolen souls. They will forever be drawn to the Traveler's energy. They are no longer fallen or cabal. A hive god changed them with the dark powers he stole. Mm. He. Wait. Is Gaul's plan to do the same, but with the light? That has to be it. That's interesting. Well, yeah, there. What do if if that's the case? What do Cabal plan on changing the people? be mining the traveler's remnant energy in the hopes of transforming himself and the red legion into wielders of the light oh if all that of course yeah he will become immortal yeah pretty uh we have to tell Savala baseline basic line for uh, villains mm -hmm. gotta have the invulnerability then you can rule the world but yeah you know what's the point of ruling the world if you can't enjoy it yeah then you you become bored and everything becomes become pointless and guess what and then you realize what you've done and <laughs> it's too late to turn back yeah you become emperor callus a giant space bug <laughs> yeah no kidding the bug of the universe that nobody likes <laughs> pretty much i don't know if he was in the first destiny i don't think he was actually uh, not too sure I didn't play the first Dennis Nay, so I would know that. I don't I don't think you ever run into him in the base story. Oh, base story of Destiny? One? Yeah, I don't know if he was in any of the DLCs. Okay. Yeah. This is a sky shock alert! Someone or something drew the taken here! Asher Mir? Is that you? Irrelevant! The taken <laughs> is sapping the moon's energy! I <laughs> hypothesize that Io will implode if someone does not intervene! Guardian, we cannot lose this sacred place. Do what must be done. Stop the Taken. Yes, we shall. Taken that is immune, okay. Kind of portal. Stop them! Stop those mindless vermin intend to summon every last one of their spectral friends to devour Oh, they got wizards. Room. Ouch. Freaking phalanx. I hate them. I relate. Push you off edges and blast you with their shields. Especially in that challenge we did. Oh man. Uh, what was it, the Ascendant challenge or something? Yeah. Yeah, it was, was more it was nice to get pushed off the edge the last moment <laughs> we we were just finishing. At least you got it finished. <laughs> At least it counted as a triumph for me. Uh, yeah, that's true. I didn't know what they're doing. Oh, it's coming down. Looks like we closed the portal. And 
Why am I still seeing abnormal neutrino scattering? Hang on. We're gonna take a closer look. We definitely didn't close it. Ah, remedy this mess, you fools! Ah, <laughs> you fools! Uh, you, you think we're some kind of joke, eh? Oh yeah, that worked. Whoa! No, oh. I'm blind. Yeah, I was blind for a moment too. Portals closed. We're clear. Oh, they are allies. I know this place is. Uh, what? I have no idea. So she thinks they're left. Is like, can't shoot them. Left to give, and I will give it gladly to stop Gaul. Oh my gosh! What is this? Huh. How strange! This is Vex technology for sure. But it looks so primitive. Why am I? Why is my screen so fuzzy? It's like radiation. It's because of the. Uh, oh my! It's, my eyes hurt. Yeah, it looks so weird. Yay! We've been saved. Ah, <laughs> we've been saved from the weird glitchiness. Yeah, I think we killed them too fast. Probably. Sped through most of the progress. I mean, supers are pretty OP, anyways. Yeah, that's true. Hashtag why I save them for bosses. Oh, yes. Okay, where to next? Speak to Asher. Oh, yes, he's over here. Yeah. Ooh, Speaking. Actually, actually kind of sucks. I don't know if you can actually get exotics from doing I this don't stuff. Care. So before you did the quest, the so Red Legion quest, you could express historic and exotics. Supported by any data. However, there are remnants of an old interplanetary defense network here. We shall use it to assess the Almighty's capability. Alright, we're going to talk to him. Then, we will tell Zavala precisely why his plan is wrong. And oh, I will relish that. Meanwhile... I refuse to squander valuable research opportunities. Therefore, you shall be my assistant. Go. All this hey, are you allowed to choose any exotic gear after you press accept? There's no exotic gear displayed. Yeah, so because see, when you did the main quests, originally you'd be able to choose, you'd be given like three or two exotic gears to choose between. I'd like... I like that helmet for the hunter, but I like it on my warlock. I would like to have something like that on my warlock too. What? Okay, I'm just it's like a, it's like a big old dome. It's just smooth, looks sleek. Yeah, we have like a, ours. There's is a full Don't mask. Some treasure to hunt? Yeah, like a full like a like a, like a, there's a frame and then there's the helmet. Right. Which is the class, looks like anyway. All right, I think we'll do one more and then clip the video. All right, I like Asher's mirror though. On his, I was like Gemini, Jes Jesnim Knight rubs. It says, "Have you ever considered that the traveler might be just as chaotic and arbitrary as everything else?" That is an interesting thought. Yeah. All right, so we've got Fury. Help Ikora use the war mine on Io to learn more about the Almighty. Turn the tide of the war. You ready? I'm ready as ever. Alright, here we go. Launching. Alright, I'm in. I'll just have to just wait for you. Yep. My loading sucks. <laughs> uh, happens to us all sometimes. Except to me, it happens all the time. Don't worry. Oh well, I mean, I've had my times of really bad loading screens, and uh, it's like when it happens, it happens for nearly the entire day. Okay. All right. Here we go. Fury, locate the warm mine vault. And uh, locate over here. Let's go check out what this vault has, yeah? Yeah. I wish the objective would stay on my screen instead of me having to always press tab. 
Yeah, I get what you mean. As we all know, it wasn't Sama like me. Plans to attack the Almighty. Typical Titan idiocy. <clears throat> I'm sure he thought, ah, Gaul has a Sun Destroyer. I don't need a plan. I'll simply headbutt it. <laughs> it's desperation, Asher. Yeah. Zavala has forgotten he might die his final death. Need them no heed, assistant. You and I can deal with them later. Head toward the heart of the energy mining operation, Guardian. We'll use a war mine. Part of an interplanetary Wait, defense let's network see. to scan the Almighty. We can just waltz up in here. <laughs> Ign <laughs> ignore the fight. <laughs> Just like, oh, don't worry. We're just, uh, you know, we're just, um, forget the word. We found another drill. This one's big. Real um, big. hold on. Good. We'll just that waltz right in. An entrance to the war mine vault. The scanner's inside. Gotcha. Let's find the drill controls and get it out of the way. Although a good one, I was thinking of something else. For some reason I couldn't think I just can't think of it just yet. Nice. He's not dead yet. Oh, is that another guy? That's another guy. Yeah. I I legit saw that Minotaur's body fold. <laughs> Uh, okay. We've got the power going, but the drill is still in oh, the way. Oh, that's what I was trying to say. I'll but wait till this stuff. Commitment to safety standards. There has to be a manual override somewhere in that base. Oh, we'll find the override hmm. then. <laughs> but what I was gonna say is what. Oh, don't mind this. We're just tourists. Oh. <laughs> we're just trolling on by. Legion ignorant, I did not realize they were drilling directly into a war mine vault. Stranger things happen every day. I'm detecting a spike in paracausal energy. Sterile neutrino particles have quintupled. He means watch out for the taken. You should hire a translator, Asher. <laughs> Yeah, no really kidding. Serious. He's always speaking scientific terms. That's all he knows. He's just too smart. I'm surprised he's a no warlock. Oh, what, what is, is he? No idea. He seems like a warlock, just based off his clothing. Maybe. Well, his clothing changes. Actually, no, you got a point. Why doesn't he just... Why don't he just let himself die and then, you know, kind of revive himself with a new arm? Well, based off the story, we're the only ones with the light. Well, I meant before that. Ah. I mean, when he did lose his arm. Right. Oh, I see. You sure he had light? He used to be a good member. He had a fire team. Oh, fair enough. And when you look at the gauntlets, he'll say, I helped these two you more good than they did me. Maybe he preferred having a robotic arm. Maybe. But why would we want revenge for if it if it did him better? Hmm. He's confusing. <laughs> yeah, he's confusing. Yeah, where's this going? Uh, it's not exactly. S Hold on. No, scan this. It's not telling us, is it? Oh, we gotta kill this guy. That's why he was invisible. Oh, pfft. go figure. Yeah, it's starting up some more. Looks like we really startled them this time. Oh yeah. There we go. Nice work. Yeah. Find that override. Oh, I missed the ledge for just a moment there. I think we've got the drill going. Good. Be 
return to the drill site and get into the war mind vault. I am eager to discredit Voo Voo Zela's plan to attack <laughs> 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 He just does not care for his name. He will discredit I mean, that name. He will. <laughs> That's a good one, Voo Voo Zela. I remember that next time. Hey there, Voo Voo Zela. How do you do? You got some more strike missions for me? <laughs> Imagine if if they could really hear you say that, like they had some sort of voice activation, they'd be like, what, what did you hear that? <laughs> yeah, that'd be hilarious. Oh, I wish that was an option now. But I know it isn't. Oh, man. If it was, imagine this world being so... So more... Ten, like 10 times more interactive. And people calling Zavala Zuzu Zavala. Zuzu No kidding. Whoa, the drill's on. What? Lift it up before it collapses the war mine vault. Do this? I don't get what I'm supposed to be doing. Oh, opposite side. Oh, yeah, yeah. Just make my way up there. Lift in the drill. Let's get down to the vault. Ooh, that is a big drill. Oh yeah. And we got enemies going in. That's fun. Jumping down. Ooh. Ooh, not that far. <laughs> Well, I've been lied to. <laughs> I I about fell down there myself. <laughs> but there's an opening right here. <laughs> this will be rich. I will uh, Can you tell me in Zeta Jules the Almighty's expected destructive capacity? And he will say Zeta Jules. Oh, Asher, I cannot, because I am a reckless. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> I don't want to ignore him, he's pretty funny. Oh man, he's just giving Zavala a whole bunch of pack. Yeah, he, he did not put up with Zavala. He's like, you are wrong. Oh, he even said that he'd relish in the moment that he was he was right this time over Zavala. Oh yeah, I mean I would too. That's Zavala's personality. Well, you know, big tough guys don't usually focus on intelligence all the time. <laughs> At least Zavala yeah. does have some intelligence once in a he while. Has 20, he has 20 intellect. Not good enough to open the door by himself, though. Connecting to the War Mine Network to begin a remote scan. No wonder all the doors slide open. Yes, we can see the connection coming online. Oh dear. Oh yes. You know how to dish him out. Oh, hi there. Yep, he got wrecked. Wasn't even there for five seconds. Oh, warlocks. We warlocks have awesome capacity for destruction. Team. Damn. That's some serious stuff right there. No kidding. If you can blow up the sun, if the machine is blown up. Oh boy. Here we go. Tell me again, speaker. What makes your guardians worthy of the light? What is the price of such power and immortality? Devotion. Self-sacrifice. Death. Death. Explain. 
devotion inspires bravery. Bravery inspires sacrifice. Sacrifice leads to death. So, feel free to kill yourself. <laughs> That's good. Oh, yeah. yeah. Sacrifice. I was born an outcast. A runt. As is custom with the Cabal, I was cast aside and left for dead. I was taken in by an old scholar himself, disgraced, who saw in me something redeemable. Mm. He raised me, taught me, trained me, and in return, I would become a vehicle for his revenge against an empire that failed him, that failed itself. Rejection, ridicule, torment. It made me stronger. I gave everything to win, not just acceptance, but glory. Beneath my mask, Sticker, is the face of devotion and sacrifice. I will not take the light by force. To do so would be to admit failure. And I never fail. Mm. Now, do you see what I will be chosen? I see now. I see all that you have done. Our operation on the Jovian Room was a success. Once the cage is complete, we will have everything we need to begin the process of extracting the light. Dominus, everything we've worked for is here, for the taking. All that remains is your word. No, this is not the way, old friend. But it is the way. In indifferences. I wonder what's gonna happen next. No kidding. I mean, what happens when crew and captain have a difference and people start chatting, and gossiping? What if mutiny. there? What if there is mutiny? What if there is conflict? What if? They go against the captain's plans and do something that uh, <laughs> causes major trouble. <laughs> That's something to think about, definitely on the next episode. Most certainly. And this thing's almost an hour long, so hopefully I can cut and trim some of this stuff. Well, well, well. What we have here. So really what you're saying is, we're damned if we do, damned if we don't. On the contrary. Now that we are together again, we just might stand a chance. The fact is, if we destroy that weapon, we will ignite a chain reaction that could send our son into a supernova. Well, at least we have each other. Indeed. And he had the chicken. <laughs> needs to be the traveler must be I can see where they made the emote from. Us and a big fat pile of explosives can get the job done. Look, I still have that Vex teleporter. It's got a limited range, so we'll have to get a little too close for comfort. Then we get inside the city walls for it to be effective. But without the light, an outright assault on the wall is doomed to fail. We could... There will be no coming back. It's worth it. How do we get in? You know, the city wall is kind of like this bar. Plenty of places to slip in unseen, so long as you know how. You sure you're not one of my hunters? <laughs> not really into capes. Clearly. <laughs> nice poncho. You need to get your team into the city uh. without raising any alarms. My people and I can help you do that. 
We also happen to be pretty good at shooting bad guys. Hawthorne, it's one thing for us to put our lives on the line, but this doesn't have to be your fight. You're not a... A guardian? You Ooh. think you've cornered the market on sacrifice? You forget that we've had to survive without the light all our lives. Once upon a time, that big white ball in the sky was there for all of us. I think it's about time we return the favor. Guardians or not. That's great speech and all, but let's not forget about the whole supernova and complete annihilation thingy. If we can't destroy the Almighty, we'll have to disable its weapon. And that means getting a certain Guardian on board. We'll need a good disguise if we're going to fly right through a Cabal Armada. If it's a Cabal ship you need, there's a base nearby full of them. But it won't be easy sneaking in. Well, we're done sneaking. If there's one thing I've learned from Cade, it's the value of a grand entrance. This is great. <laughs> Anyone want a hug? Hugs? No? <laughs> no hugs. Okay. <laughs> of Cade course. You would learn something from Cade like that. A grand entrance. <laughs> Busts open insane. the door and says, Howdy, folks. <laughs> We've brought plenty of guns to say hello with. Uh, that's good. That's good. Well, that was definitely... And we're definitely getting into the meat, meaty parts of the story. Oh, yeah. Oh, man, it's so nice to be able to see the team get together and actually work together for once. I mean, come on. <laughs> we got to see Cade yeah. get stuck in an internal loop. <laughs> oh, for my <laughs> love, cut <God> socks! <laughs> uh, that, you gotta love Cade. Sorry, but I, I didn't know Cade, so whenever you told me about that little bit of piece of story later on, I was kind of like, oh man, that sucks. Uh, but. You know what? <laughs> Once uh, certain parts of this game start to open up, and you start to see how much effort is put into the story, and how it's... <laughs> it feels like a movie. It really mm -hmm. does. It feels like a movie. They've done so well with their cinematics. It just... It's awesome. Cotton sucks. Cotton sucks. <laughs> gonna remember that. Gonna have to remember that forever, because that was a good one. Oh, for love of cut socks! Did you hear me? <laughs> All right, but yeah, that's it's getting good. We're and as Jack said, it seems like we're getting near the end, which means that's all the sooner we get to Shadow Keep, as I promised Jack that we would do afterwards. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed watching this video. This has been uh, another episode of Red Legion War gameplay campaign. Hope to see you again next episode. Bye-bye. Goodbye.